The image for Stranger Love is actually a composite of three different photographs, and each of those photographs represent a sort of important theme that tracks throughout the span of the opera. The first photo, which is kind of the underpainting for the entire image, is uh, a famous photograph taken by Mervyn O'Gorman in the early 20th century, and it has a name, it's called Christina in Red, and that's the image where you see this girl walking along the Jurassic Coast. And for us, that image represents this important sense within Stranger Love, which is the, the smallness of ourselves against the landscape. This piece offers this experience of perspective, of seeing ourselves uh, as we are against the vastness of time and the universe and this planet and all of its beautiful revolving seasons. And so that image offers this um, strong sense, I think, of, of that feeling of love, of mortal love for this world and for the things that change, the things that disappear up against the endlessness of time. The second image that's overlaid, and it's actually hard to know is there, uh, is a shot taken by Thomas Barcher, the co-creator and the librettist of Stranger Love, which is a shot of the moon over water. And so the moon is a kind of connective touchstone for all of the characters throughout Stranger Love. The third image is actually an image that I took of two jet trails that have crossed each other in the sky. And that image is important to us because it gives this little hint of this thread that moves throughout Stranger Love of the words of John McGee Jr., who was uh, a pilot in the Royal Air Force in 1941, who at 18 wrote the famous words, I have slipped the surly bonds of earth and danced the skies on laughter silvered wings. And John McGee Jr.'s uh, spirit and his words kind of permeate the entirety of Stranger Love in various ways that you'll find out in January.